In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up your Canvas course. So you start from the Harbor College website, go to your portal. This is also how students will, re will access Canvas. <clears throat> Select your Canvas course. And here you're going to have the list of your courses. So uh, let's try and... <coughs> Sorry empty oops <laughs> I'm sick um, empty sandbox on the left hand side here go all the way down to setting you can select an image um, as a cover for your course so let's go to unsplash let's say that I have a nutrition class and I can select an image here, that's what the students will see. Then you want to change the date, set up the dates. So we're starting on the 23rd. And you can put an end date for the end of the semester. And then you have to select one uh, or more of those boxes. So first box here, students can only participate in the course between these dates. It means that Outside of this date, let's say if tomorrow they want to go on the course, they can look at everything that's on there. However, they cannot participate. They cannot do any assignment. They cannot ask questions or anything. So if this is what you want, select this box here. Um, restrictions from viewing this course after end date. And then restrictions from viewing this course before start date. I like to leave this one blank because I like students to be able to see the course before the semester starts. And then click update course details. Another thing I'd like to show you here is the student view. So when you access the student's view here on the upper right corner, it shows you exactly what student will see from your course. And you can even test out your assignments or anything you want. Uh, so you know exactly what students see. Before you leave, I suggest you reset student um, because otherwise, let's say you start an assignment, you try an assignment and you forgot to reset it. When you come back, the assignment will already be started. So you know you're in student view because there's the border here, the purple border. When you are done, leave student view. Let's go back to the setting. One more thing here. In the navigation, here, it allows you to get rid of everything that you don't need for your course. You can add it back on any time. So initially you have the announcement. Uh, you can also move things up and down. So if you want the syllabus, I like to have the syllabus maybe all the way on top. Um, I like to have my modules also up. The discussions, assignments, you leave the grade, you leave the people, you can move everything down beside this, so it makes it easier for your students. And you want to leave NetTutor here, and then make sure you click Save. So this completes the setting for your uh, course. Next video, I'll show you how to work on the specific areas within your course.